up good people welcome back to yet another amazing amazing video my beautiful name is Nicole and Grace and guys I'm coming live from my village Kiamokama located in Kisi County and guys today we want to experience something really new okay not really new this is what we used to do when we were kids but right now things have like advanced and people are trying to live like the modern way here in the village you get so guys today we want to embrace the simplicity of an outdoor shower and i'm so excited to try that out with you guys well i think some people still do that but not most most of the people so yeah that's what we are about to do right now and you know what guys when i say outdoor i mean we are going to the river to have our shower over there yeah look at how beautiful our tea plantation looks like Aki, my grandfather <gasps> r.i.p to him but he really did a good job to grab all this land and also plant all these tea leaves this is such this is such an invest an investment wow anyway guys we are at the river already and we are about to take our shower so watch out for that make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoy and here So guys, we've actually um, found some kids here. We found some kids here and they are, I don't know, they are eating some wild fruits. That is an epic fall. Anyway, let's see what they are eating and also we want to try that out. Guys, look at my hands. Okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Hi. 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 So, guys, the kids. Hi. Hi. So, these kids, guys, are here in the forest. They are here to like collect firewood. So, let's see what they are eating. This one. Nizi mnakula? Nkie kie. Na kichiko roku. Chi? Nkomoni? Chi nkomoni. Hii neza kulo? So let's try this out. Ah. Mm -mm. Hi. Nimekula mbaya? Eyu ne mbe? Ziko api? Eyu ne ngia kose? Eh? Eyu ne teri ngia. Guys, we were coming to like take a bath, but but now we found some kids here collecting. Uh, this is firewood. So let's let's now start treasure hunting for this uh, chinkomoni. I don't know what they are called in English, but chinkomoni. So let's try that out before we take our bath. So they are here. Oh wow! Look at that. Oh, thank you. Now, let's try this out, guys. This is chinkomoni. Hmm, that was nice. Yoni tamu. Ndo ingine. Ndo izi yuku. Iko sawa kweli. Let's try. Sinonja bizuri. Anyway, asanti. Into to acha kosi bichi anga, to isibi, to iranenka. Aya, unenda? Guys, I don't know what's here. Engoro yene yeki, yanki yeki. 
I don't know what's this, but guys, normally here in the village, for those who haven't like gotten uh, gas to use, they usually just come to this forest. As you can see, guys, this is a whole forest, and apparently, Water comes from the rocks. they collect firewood over here. Let me show you water that is coming from the rocks you guys look at that guys this is fresh water this is fresh water that can be drank i don't know my hands are dirty i could have shown you but let me wash my hands okay my sister can drink this water to prove this water is clean and this is where people fetch water from and they drink like this water well, like oh my shit. god i know mitamu it's very very sweet guys i think life in the vi village is very simple and manageable mm -hmm. and like in nairobi you, people usually buy water and maybe that water is removed from here and then they they lie to you that they are i don't know doing some what process of cleaning huh so that's it anyway let's get to Taking our shower, I'm so excited about this video, but I don't know this if I'll scare these kids away, but let's take our shower. We're not going to take our shower here because this is clean water for drinking. For drinking. So we're going to take our shower. We're going to take our shower on the other river. But before that, let me show you something. Yo, I thought uh, collecting firewood was just moving around and collecting firewood. Apparently it's some heavy task so this kid look at that kid he's going to go till up there where the branches have dried so that he can collect some firewood that's what he's doing uh bringing the branches down and then the other kids will collect them and then guys over here we have some bricks these bricks are actually made from mud i don't know how they cook them but they are made from mud and then i don't know how they dry them i wish i could have someone to tell me how that is done and i can see there are bunches there is a house made over there like this one that has more bricks there is another one on the other side oh my god there's so many but you guys can't see because of the trees we also have a uh, what beehive Oh yeah! Let me take you guys to that beehive before I go and take my shower. Oh my god, this place is so adventurous to, to, to like explore. Let's let's go to that beehive before guys we can take our shower. Whew. Guys, look at these kids. Look at this before guys go to the beehive. I guys I'm just all over. But look at these kids climbing these trees only to go and collect like two or three branches. Guys oh my god this is literally life in the village nayona guys can can you see that that bird can you see these kids wow so the kids are climbing to collect firewood oh this is amazing So my sister wants to prove me wrong that she can climb this tree. Let's see. Try. Try it. No sooner has she started. She hasn't managed. Guys, you are going to come back to see where the kids have reached with collecting their firewoods. But first, let me take you guys to the beehive. I hope I won't get stung by a bee. Oh my god. <laughs> so that's the beehive i don't want to go close because i love myself and yeah that's what it looks like i'm so afraid maybe the bees are inside there you guys have seen though people here also do beekeeping bee farming bee farming 
yeah so that's it let's take our bath now you guys can hear the branches wow the kids are collecting firewood Msianguke kutoka hapo juu. Kwanza wewe usikanyage hiyo branch na ikuangushe. So guys, we have some flowing water over here and this is where I'm going to take my shower from. So let's see how it goes. So disclaimer guys, this is not this is not what we usually do like on a daily basis but some people usually do this and i want to experience what other people experience when come when they come to the river and take a shower so yeah let's explore the simplicity of an outdoor shower as the title suggests let's explore this now guys we are about to start our shower and I have my soap over here and then we have this is actually something that everyone everyone in the village uses we call it in our in our language and I also have this bathing towel I don't know what it's called in English but let's take a bath okay guys the water is so cold oh my god This one I'm going to use to wash my leg. So let's start. She got on the leg. I'm going to record this. I'm going to look at my leg. Especially for the moment. Bongo is a dry man. Bongo? When I cut, I'm going to get a picture. I'm going to get a picture. I'm going to get a picture. I'm going to Guys, that was the coolest shower I've ever had in my entire life. It has already started raining. Let me tell you one thing: in the village, it rains like after every second. Right now, I want to wash my legs. I'm using this Kenyorini. 
If you know what it's called in English, you can comment down below. So let's wash our legs and also I'm going to wash my slippers. And then that will be it. And also guys, we have some clothes that you want to, to wash. Yeah, I to a challenge in Ambuo. Mm. So guys, this is how we wash our legs using this kinyorini and as I mentioned earlier, I don't know what it is called in English but yo, this shower is amazing huh? and I also want to wash these slippers of mine Camera, yeah, well, in a eco waterproof. Oh, you must be called up, man. Record, in a record. Cadibia, come good. Make sure my flounce, my nails, my beard. So, yeah, I'm not taking my family to talk to you. Guys, we are now clean and set to wear our clothes. It's already raining. Ha. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Let's shelter somewhere and then we'll end this vlog later. Bye bye. Yo, the rain have actually uh, stopped me from enjoying my beautiful bath. <laughs> But guys, I feel so fresh. Now I want to change my clothes. I want to change my clothes. And that's it for this video. By the way, those kids who are collecting firewoods have already gone home. The rain has started and they have left, but they have collected quite some firewood. Wow, that was a lot. I don't think me at this age, I can do what those kids have done. I'm actually challenged. So, See you guys. Bye bye. Always remember, guys, in a world where you could be anything, just be kind. And, guys, comment down. Let me know what you think about an outdoor shower. This is so cool. Oh my god. This is so. That was so cool. I've actually enjoyed that experience. Hello. Hello. So, guys, we've actually taken a shelter over here. Roger. We've actually taken our shelter over here so that I can wear some dry clothes and then wait for the rain to calm down so that you can go back home. If you guys enjoy this video, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and tell me what you think about my traditional village bath. What do you think? Uh, me guys, honestly, because I'm the one who has experienced it, it was amazing i actually feel so fresh i don't know if i've ever had like such a bath in my entire life well if i if i've ever had it's it's long time i can't even remember but it just rejuvenated my inner child and i just feel good i hope you guys will give this video a big thumbs up and sub share subscribe if you haven't subscribed turn on the notification bell if you haven't done that yet and See you on my next upload. I love you all.